so the topic of consent is very, very big in healing trauma and Matt is one of the world's experts on consent. He's worked a lot with Betty Martin and the Wheel of Consent and he's also got his own school, the School of Consent that he's just building now, which is really exciting. So um, can you share a little bit about consent, how you work with it and mm. how it helps people with trauma? Mm. So what the main thing is about consent is that we all know that before we touch us touch somebody or getting touched that it needs a consensual agreement between us and consent is not a new concept everybody knows that we just have to have that in place but the main thing that the wheel of consent and Betty Martin's work or the school of consent that we just launched has in place is that we show that there is a different dynamic in the wheel of consent that is separating doing from giving so that we can find a deeper layer of receiving. And it's pretty much when you just look into the wheel of consent, uh, the taking aspect of the wheel. So the taking aspect is where we're making on a sensual way connection to our sensation in our skin first, where we identify as a somatic embodied experience that we are capable of receiving pleasure while we're doing. So I would like to repeat that, receiving pleasure while we are doing. The important piece about this consent is that when we reach out in touching somebody else for our pleasure, that we need to ask this person, hey, may I feel you? So you want to show that? Yeah. So, so, so the question is, hey, may I feel your arm? Yes, you yeah. may. So, and, and then I tune in and start to feel it the way how I want to feel it. So I choose the action by the pleasure that I feel. Shashi probably very much feels pleasure as well because there are so-called mirror neurons in her nervous system. <laughs> but that's the bonus, that's the byproduct. Important is that I'm in connection with the pleasure in my skin, in my hand first. However, thank you for your hand. <laughs> if this is not in place, this agreement this consent when it comes to this touch Shashi's nervous system would probably detect mm -hmm. if I would touch her for my own pleasure without having checked in and asked for anything she would detect every touch in an instant as an invasion oh yeah like a violation it feels like you're taking from me without asking right and this taking mm -hmm. without asking this is causing on the other side the so-called freeze response or the shutdown what mm. we call the victimization of the allowing quadrant in the wheel mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and this needs to be in place first and as soon as this is embodied the wheel makes really sense and kind of as Betty says that it f falls easy into your lap. Mm -hmm. So I think it's what what this brings up for me is the thought of when you go for a massage and you're expecting to be given touch and expecting it to be for you but if actually it feels like the massage therapist is getting more pleasure than you are, then you feel kind of ripped off and you feel taken advantage of, right? So this is what you're talking about, right. this kind of... Yeah. So being super clear about who's doing what is how to be clearer with consent. Yeah, and what I would like to say on that point as well, that there are two different distinctions that are really important, and one is the so-called treatment. And in the treatment is the giving and doing person the expert, mm -hmm. yeah? and of course they having a clear intention and in the work based on the wheel of consent is that we as practitioner of consent we co-create a dynamic with the client who is the expert on their body sensation mm -hmm. yeah mm -hmm. so these are two different models we're working with mm -hmm. yeah that's great it brings a lot of languaging to things that i think people experience and don't have any way of understanding yeah. great so uh, we'll put some links to the Wheel of Consent and the School of Consent so you can find out more about that and I'm sure you'll find it really helpful in your journey of understanding better your boundaries and consent and agreement fields to make it really safe to enter intimacy, touch or receiving sessions from other people. Mm. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. <laughs>